what you get them. Check it out now. The Ain't a Booty Gang General, Kevin Gates, he gonna have to put that shit on pause, okay? Ain't no booties getting eight, nigga, okay? Ain't no dogs getting their dick sucked. By the way, these are things that Kevin Gates has said before while trolling online, okay? Because when he showed up to court today, his case was decided and the judge decided that he was going to prison for 30 months, okay? In Cook County Jail, okay? Well, actually, he's not gonna be in Cook County Jail. He's gonna be transferred to... Illinois Correctional Facilities. However, Kevin Gates, who I predicted would have gotten out on bail for his gun charge in Chicago, he never got bail. And while we have seen other people who live in Chicago beat their gun case, he ain't beat his, okay? I don't know what's up with his lawyer situation. He took an L down in Florida. He served like five months. And now he got sentenced for 30 motherfucking months because of his gun case. So basically he's getting sentenced for um, having a gun and also using it, okay? Or threatening to use it. We're not too sure what the context is there, okay? Remember, the reason why he was not released after he got out of jail is in Florida is because of an extradition warrant that really dragged him to Chicago. And this whole thing is from 2013, okay? Now, they will be transferring him to the Illinois Department of Corrections, and I feel incredibly bad for Kevin Gates, but these are things that eventually he would have ran into, and he has to get these things out of the way that he could continue with his career. If we're being realistic, and I'm going to have to just tell you out of harsh reality rather than probably sugarcoating as I may have did previously because we usually think Chirac is joking when they catch niggas with guns and people using guns because there's so much gun crime going there. But they clearly had enough proof and they weren't budging with Kevin Gates. So we have to be realistic. They're saying 30 months if he's lucky gets out in 24. Okay, they'll probably also give him some some credit for time served. So we probably ain't seen this thing until 2019. Okay, that sounds crazy to me because I definitely expected him to get out of jail this month or next month and really be with us for the summer and the winter. Now, let's talk about his career in 2019 or 2018, most likely 2019. When he gets out of that, are people still checking for Kevin Gates? I think so. Okay, do I think this really gives a roadblock in his career? Because he just went platinum with no features. He was going really well. And, of course, everything that's added up to him getting, getting arrested is stopping his whole musical momentum. I'm not sure if he comes back and gets this wave instantly. He'll get a buzz when he comes back out, like every rapper who gets freed, okay? However, I can't just blindly say that he'll come back to the same amount of clout and the same amount of fan anticipation and will be making the same type of music. You got to imagine that jail is definitely taking a toll on him. We've seen physical pictures of him, and it looked like he's going through some things, okay? So it's a lot of spiritual growth that I would expect to be happening. He might come out a whole different person, okay? My prayers is with Kevin Gates and his family. Very sad situation all around. What do you guys think about this? Get in the comments. Make sure you guys like. Then subscribe to more academics. I'm up.